Hello and welcome to episode three. My name is Joseph. Today we're going to be covering creating a triangle in Google Make. Um, and in this episode, we'll be covering how to use the draw tool and snapping to some um, the lineal directions in Google Make. So the first thing I'm going to do is this lady in the middle here. I'm just going to right click her and erase. We don't need her on screen. I'm then going to just reorientate my screen a little bit and we'll start. So the first thing I'm going to do is take a line tool and I'm going to draw from the center outwards a line of four meters. Now you'll see here under my length I get my length I'm trying to draw at and if I snap to the red direction you'll see that my cursor snaps pretty much easily on there and it says I'm on the red axis. I'm going to set it to four meters by using my number pad and then hitting enter while I'm on that axis. Next, we're going to draw, so I'm going to hit the escape key to cancel my connections here. I'm then going to go along the red, uh, sorry, not red line, the black line that we've created. We've got an end point here, the origin and end point there, and we've got a midpoint here. I'm going to click on the midpoint. I'm going to draw about three meters out. So again, I'm going to use the three on my number pad and hit the enter key while I'm on the green axis and you'll see what I mean so you'll see I'm on the green axis so again whoop, I want three meters and you can see here now um, I can either choose to cancel my um, pencil stroke by hitting the escape and then I can click on my endpoint to endpoint and endpoint to endpoint so now we've got a very basic triangle super easy to do I'm gonna take my eraser tool and I'm just going to get rid of this line in the middle because we don't need it anymore. I'm going to repeat this step. So I'm now going to find the midpoint again on this line. So again, I'm looking at this line here. I'm going to find the midpoint. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to go again three meters up, as you can see. And I went along the blue axis. I'll repeat that again. So you can see I'm on the blue axis. I'm hitting three and enter. I'm then just going to do a join on both those vertices. I'm going to erase that line again. And now when I rotate, you can see I've got two parts to a triangle. In the last step, I'm going to take this line tool and I'm going to draw a line to an endpoint to an endpoint like so. And you'll see now I've got a three-dimensional triangle in Google SketchUp. So that's the basics of just creating a very simple shape in Google SketchUp. It shouldn't be a hard thing to do. So the idea is is you're just drawing some very basic shapes with the pencil tool to kind of generate the vertices we'll use the right terminology here to create the shapes you're looking for so i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial again a very quick and easy one and i hope you guys have a great day